Hi, uh, I'm Michael. I'm the Area Director of Sales and Marketing of IHE Cluster Festival City. Um, so four properties, three brands. Very happy to be here, Chris. Thank you. Okay, well, good afternoon. A pleasure to see you. Um, perhaps we could just start with the Interconti property here and um, what's on offer to this, uh, this very important market here in the Middle East. Well, Intercontinental is really the grand dam of, of our cluster, 510 bedrooms. It's very popular with the GCC, uh, very big in terms of my space as well, and uh, connected to the mall, so there's a lot of facilities on offer, and it's by far one of the best mice clusters of the Middle East, but not just that, leisure as well, so it uh, has a big impact on the GCC market. Could you tell me a little bit about who comes here? Do you welcome a lot of people from internationally, domestic market? Who are your key source markets? Good question. So uh, a bit of everything. GCC is an important part. I mean, Saudi business, of course, the local uh, Emiratis, very important too. But the international clientele demographics have been uh, quite substantial over the years since we've opened 13 years ago. Uh, a little bit less with COVID, but still, of course, very strong now that we're going over the pandemic. So a bit of a mix, really. Uh, very uh, heavy, though, on the GCC for sure. And how would you describe the market here in the Middle East currently? Obviously, COVID has been, uh, had a huge impact around the world, but uh, this was one of the quickest markets to recover. Spot on. Uh, we are so fortunate to be in Dubai in the Middle East. Uh, it's been uh, uh, quite a journey for all of us around the world. But uh, we saw very quickly recovers of, uh, recovery of the GCC, of the UAE as well. And uh, we saw occupancy rise very quickly, starting with the staycations, local business, domestic travel, obviously. But very quickly and before everyone else, uh, uh, corporate meetings, corporate travel as well. Uh, so yeah, we are fortunate. So I think just second to Asia, we're the, one of the main markets that saw that growth uh, post-pandemic. Yeah, it's great to hear some good news there. Um, Expo 2020 as well, the headlines mm -hmm. from uh, UAE and from the Middle East as a whole. It's a fantastic event. Absolutely. And what better period, after it got postponed, what better period to have Expo than now? Uh, we should be very proud for what the UAE government has done for all of us and to bring this magnificent event, which we've seen already some really interesting traces of new business and demographics coming to our hotels and to the UAE in general, not just to Dubai. Uh, and it's, you know, the greatest show on earth. We should always be, uh, you know, very proud. And uh, indeed, uh, it's, it's a great event and we see already the magnitude of such. And let me, offer me, let me offer you my congratulations as well. Middle East leading city hotel at the World Travel Awards. A very prestigious title there. You know, uh, it's the culmination of a great year and it's down to the team actually to be again awarded with such an amazing accolade, especially with this platform, which everyone wants to be. And uh, us as a, one of the you know, leading, uh, leading city hotel uh, for the UAE, uh, for the GCC, it's um, absolutely phenomenal. So we're very proud and definitely will be using that as a USP moving forward. And just finally, a very exciting time for the wider company as well. A lot of focus on leisure. Yes, you know, um, I like to say we are leisureizing. It's kind of my own word, but uh, corporate travel has uh, diminished. Um, so we had to adapt to the new trends and leisure is here to stay. I mean, here in the UAE specifically with Ramadan being pushed forward into April, our high season more and more, I think hoteliers need to focus on leisure. And this hotel, this cluster like everyone else we are ready for that and we've done some progressive uh, initiatives okay. well i really appreciate your time and thank, thank you. you so much thank you amazing thank you very much for your time pleasure to be here thank you